hello the special features thank you for watching this because I think you're probably the only person in the world that is if you're watching this um, we're gonna do some sound checks to work out what how to achieve um, the sound of Yella getting her face squashed in um, so at the moment we've got this pillow here and uh, if you look outside a bowl full of warmish water I'm effectively ruining this pillow but oh well it was probably really cheap ah water everywhere that was obviously going to happen right here we go no that's rubbish too much whack not enough squelch right new idea this might get a bit wet so I'm gonna move the camera out of the way oh yeah have a listen it's too short it's too like we want more like whoa that went everywhere that is a wet beach like I don't know normal towel shower towel shower tower shower or whatever I'm gonna try and find a way to add a bit more crunch to it like getting through bones and stuff okay I've made a little hole in the towel and put bits of spaghetti in the middle dried spaghetti um, nah, that's rubbish there's like no crunch at all okay that's quite a bit more spaghetti I'm gonna try it with that what it is doing is giving you the kind of like debris effect you can kind of hear little bits of like bone splashing everywhere but um no you don't get enough of a crunch it's probably because it's actually becoming proper spaghetti because it's wet right that's disgusting um right cleaning this mess up <laughs> all right these like dried seeds and vegetables and stuff yeah it's kind of doing the same thing as the spaghetti you know what would be perfect doritos so i'm gonna go to the shop that way, that way, and buy some Doritos. The shop doesn't open for an hour, so no, I'm not. Call me crazy, but um, what would you think if you heard like a whack and a squelch, uh, by like whacking a towel, accompanied with this? It is tin foil. for that I found around this moldy bit of cheese moldy cheese yum love this house so tinfoil sort of works um but could do better I'm thinking you got tinfoil you could rustle anything really like this nah that's too crisp this could be like I think that's the closest thing so far I'm gonna see what else we got biscuits I'm gonna try breaking some biscuits Right, we've got no biscuits in the house other than those hobnobs which belong to Paul. So I'm going to return to our old friend, Spaghetti. Um, my mum's really going to get pissed off that I've ruined all her spaghetti. Uh, but I think they could work better like behind the camera. So I'm going to try that. Yeah, no, that sounds a bit more like bone snapping rather than crunching. We don't want snapping, we want crunching. How about this? I'm going to try grinding it with... What can I grind it with? With this PlayStation DVD remote. I'm going to try that. Ah, oh, crap, I've turned on the PlayStation. That didn't really work sort of did grind but didn't make a good sound alright how's this one I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep recording these without showing you what I'm doing so you don't know what it is what I'm doing is crushing some uh, clothes with uh, the flat of a spoon like so um, smells horrible Smells like Christmas, but bad Christmas. I think that might be a bit difficult to do in the moment if, like, 
Lucy's filming with one hand and crushing and holding clothes with the other hand. She can't really crush it with her third hand because she doesn't have a third hand. Um, obviously, wow, I should get some sleep. There's no point to this now, I just like to do it. To an extent, this is massively just procrastination. I've got quite a lot of script to do, um, so I should go back and do that. Um, but no, not really, because I need to figure out what sound it makes. It's in like 12 hours time. It is actually in 12 hours time. It's like half seven. We start filming half seven. Ah, uh, shit, it's in 12 hours time. Um, I need to work out what we're doing. Oh dear. What we need to take into account is that to begin with, um, there would not be squelching. You know, there would not be squelching. You wouldn't immediately get through to muscle. So, to begin with, we'll have this noise. Then we will progress to this noise. Then we will progress to this noise. As it gets a bit more hard when he starts hitting um, onto the like skull, which would, is like the wood. And eventually, it will be literally, once he's got through that and you've heard a couple crunches, it will literally just be this. With noises like this in the background. Except louder. Right, that'll do. Um, we might have to add some of that in post-production, all the crunchy noises, but oh well. Um, probably just have to keep all the things underneath that Maria is um, uh, underneath where Maria is hiding, and she'll just have to put them in place for me to like hit in unison, like a conveyor belt of death. A conveyor belt of death. That's an amazing idea. It's probably been done before, like in Saw or something. It hasn't been done in Saw. I'm pretty sure it hasn't been done in Saw. Maybe in the last one, I don't know. I kind of zoned out during that one, it was crap. Um, stick. I made a mess.